What's going on guys, Rob from ClicksGeek.com. In today's video, we're going to go through how to exclude locations in Google Ads. This is really easy and there's a right way and a wrong way to do it. So I'm going to show you how we do it, how we've been doing it for a very long time, and this is going to help weed out any type of out of location calls or leads that you might be getting. That is a common problem now with Google Ads, especially with mobile traffic. So before we get into that, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, share this video. If you are a business owner who wants us to run Google Ads for your business for lead generation, there is a link below in the description where you can apply to work with us. Besides that, guys, let's get right into it. So we're in our demo campaign in our uh, Clone Bank Google Ads account where we house all of our campaigns. So we're in a party bus uh, campaign for this one. I've been getting fond of uh, doing all my tutorials and stuff out of this campaign as of lately. Um, today is Mar or, uh, April 26, actually. 2022. So this is a brand new video and it does apply to right now what's working and what's not. So the first thing you're going to do is log into your Google Ads account, go into the campaign that you want to exclude locations from. Next, <clears throat> you're going to come down inside the campaign. You can see here we're at the ad group level. Just come down to locations. And here you'll see all of our target locations we're going after, which in this campaign is just San Diego and San Diego County. And you can see we have a ton of exclusions. Um, it should be all the states are excluded. I don't know why these ones aren't, but we'll get to that. So that's what exclusions look like in a campaign. They're the red. So essentially when you exclude a location in Google Ads, you're telling Google, I do not want my ads to serve for any reason whatsoever in this specific location. And we do that at the state level and more granular too. So the first thing you want to do, what we do, is take a list of all 49 states besides whatever you're targeting or wherever... If you're running multiple state locations, that's fine. Just exclude all the states you're not targeting, right? So that's the first thing to do. And you look like something like this with a map of all the other states that you're not targeting. And to do that, you go under excluded right here, this little column. You'll see here we have all of our exclusion stuff. And it's really simple. To add an excluded location, all you're going to do is click this little pen icon, edit icon. And you can enter your location here and start excluding. So after you exclude the big stuff, like the other states you're not targeting, and it's as simple as just typing in like this. So Oregon's still on there, so let's do Oregon. Oregon, United States, exclude, right? So we just exclude that entire state. Then you hit save, and that's how you actually set an exclusion. So now, once you have all of your state stuff done, what you want to do, you can see here, we're only targeting San Diego County. We have all this around um, San Diego County that we got to get rid of. So the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of Mexico because it's right on the border. So we got rid of Mexico now. Next, we'll zoom in a little bit. And we want to get rid of LA, San Jose, Sacramento. And I'll do the DMAs for those. So right here, Nielsen, exclude. Let's do San Francisco. Exclude. We got Fresno. So we want to kind of go... We're excluding the areas around our target area, okay? This is going to help reduce the amount of out-of-service areas that you're getting calls or leads from because Google, they will they will um, send you uh, leads that are outside of location, especially on mobile devices, and clicks. So it's important that you try and exclude as much as possible. All right, so let's do Santa Maria. You can get as uh, granular as you want. Like, so you can go like this, or you, know, you can start doing a higher level and start doing all the cities around. It's very time consuming, but it's going to save you so much money and wasted ad spend. Palm Desert, we're going to do the DMA for that. Right? We can do these. So you kind of get what I'm doing here. Essentially, we're taking our target location and we're trying to exclude everything around it in the near vicinity as much as possible. Because we want only want Google to send us leads from inside our target location. And that's really important that you're trying to get as granular as you can and just exclude everything around your main target area. Otherwise, you are going to get calls. If this guy's targeting San Diego County, you are going to get calls from Irvine and Anaheim and Riverside and Palm Springs. It's just going to happen. It's just their algorithm it, Their algorithm is not there yet for the mobile traffic. And it kind of can come out of out of your service area, out of your target area. So that's something to uh, keep in mind when you guys are doing your campaigns. This is how we do it. This is how a lot of people do it, and um, it works. 
So hopefully this video was helpful. Again, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We have trainings every single day. Like this video, share it. Check out the links in the description. We have lots of free trainings. And if, again, if you're a business owner and you want us to run Google ads for your business, you can click to apply in the description below this video and uh, we can see if we're a good fit to work together. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow.